everyone welcome back to Odoo tutorials in this video we are going to discuss the workflow of Odoo written merchandise authorization that is Odoo RMA. Odoo RMA streamlines the process of returns and exchanges in Odoo store. Now let us see how to configure Odoo RMA in backend. Firstly we need to create different RMA stages as per your business demands. You can write a stage name related status, its sequence and description. Moreover, you need to create RMA reasons. These reasons are selected by the customers in Odoo website. Now let's move to website to see how customers can return their orders. We need to go to sales order tab in my account section and select any order which you want to return. Here you can see the return button, click on it. Now you can see the RMA form. Select request type. Select refund if you want to return the order to get refund or exchange if you want exchange of your order. Select reason of refund, add additional information. Agree to the written policy and create the RMA. From here you can see the status of RMA anytime. It is your RMA number, it's your return date with return time, product name and stage and the quantity. Now let's move back to the Odoo backend to see how stage changes. It is the RMA we just created. From here you can change the stage accordingly. Once you set the agreement stage, you can see a receive products button here. Click on it and click on return button to return the product on customer's behalf. You can click on refund invoice button for refund. Add the reason. Use specific journal and click on the reverse button. Now post it and register the payment. Let's pay it. Now let's see how the changes are reflected in website. Click on the button to view RMA and the changed state. Click on RMA number. Here you can see the written item and its detail. I hope all your doubts and queries regarding the module are resolved by now. If you still have any doubt or query, you can raise a ticket or mail our support team. Thank you.